Hello and welcome to day 17. Um, I forgot how to do 17 then. Embarrassing. And I'm still half awake. Um, so, day 17 is food storage. Toss any that don't have matching lids or bottoms and let go of unused ones. So, let's go in my cupboard and have a look and see if there's anything I can get rid of. Now, this is where I keep my food storage containers. And um, I've had these for quite a few years and as you can see they are pretty much well used. Um, I got these like, well, 2012 from Poundland. Um, they don't make them anymore, um, but I love them because they can go in the, in the dishwasher, they can go in the um, microwave. Um, so I've got bigger tubs and then I've got the smaller tubs. Now, these are made of plastic. And I'm thinking the next time I go to Ikea, I will get two lots of new tubs. And I think you can get glass ones now um, and replace these ones because these are really old and you can see they're wearing. Um, I use the small ones a lot more than the bigger ones. Um, so yeah, when I'm next to Ikea, I definitely need to get some more and then chuck these out. I like to keep one of those and of course I keep the lid on and then I do have no idea what that noise is. Um, maybe my fridge. Um, anyway and I've got these small little containers for any tiny little bits of things and um, sauces. And I've actually got two of these, but one of these are in use. Um, so that's that. I've also got um, one, two, one, two, lose. Not one then. Um, that I put grapes in. I haven't had grapes till recently, um, but it doesn't fit there, so I leave it there. So actually, today is going to be a fail because I can't chuck these out until I've got any replacements from Ikea. I think it's Ikea that do the glass ones and I think they have like plastic lids. Um, I've seen them on their website. So uh, yes, I won't be getting rid of any food storage containers today. Um, but when I do go and do a food shop at food shop, when I go and do a shopping trip at Ikea, I'll get some more containers. But if any of you guys know of another place that we can get food containers from, do let me know. So yeah. That's actually okay today. Now, I do have a confession. Last year, I sorted out my cupboards and my drawers. And I boxed a whole load of things that I haven't been using. And I thought, no, I'll keep them on top of the fridge for six months. Um, now, the good thing about this tub up here is it blocks blue from jumping up from the countertop onto the top of the fridge. However, I've never actually got rid of all the contents from out from inside the box. And as you can see, there are some container lids, which means in there, there are some containers and a whole load of other things. Can you see? Now, I've got some old food clips and stuff like that. So I'm going to pull this down from on top of the fridge and I'm actually going to get rid of the whole of this. Now, I had a really weird conversation. When I say weird, um, we were talking about food and everything and uh, with my neighbour outside and she was saying to me, oh, I love eating corn on the cob, but my fingers get really sicky um, with the cobs. And I was like, oh, I've actually got some corn on the cob things you could have. And there they are. So I'm actually going to take those out and take them over to her. Um, and she can have those for when she loves munching into a corn on the cob. Um, but other than that, all those clips I have never, ever used. I've never reached for this box since I put it up here. And um, when I get it down, I'll show you the date that I put on this box. Um, because, yeah, I think it was like September 2023. 
um, that I should have got rid of this box by. So uh, yeah, let me just grab it down from the top of this fridge. So yeah, that I haven't used at all. And there's another little container inside there. There's also this masher that I kept and I haven't made mashed potato with the masher for months. So that can definitely go. I'll have to find the video on my channel. I did this box six months I gave it 25th of September I'm sure I did that September last year so uh, yeah as you can see I'm going to get rid of everything that's inside of here um, I'll actually do a link to the video that I did when I made this box uh oh knocking things off my fridge um, but yeah Container lids, ice cube trays, another container, another container lid, more lids, chopsticks I once bought, didn't get on with them. And here are the containers that I decided to get rid of. Um, again, a lot of these are stained and looking pretty yucky. So, uh, yeah, they can go. And of course, I had a big old sort out of clips and... I'll ask my neighbours if they want any clips before I get rid of them. Um, I remember my client once gave me that and yeah I've never used it um, but as I say what I will do is I'll take out two of these and I'll give them to my neighbour because she was saying that she you know she didn't have any and uh, yeah they can go over to her um, yeah um, there for the boxes that I've kept in there but I've not used them so there's no point in keeping them um yeah so I'm going to take all of this to the shower shop I'll chuck that um but yeah all those clips I will keep this container because I normally use it for flour um so I will keep this container I know I haven't used it in six months or or a year but it tech clears for my flower um, but other than that corkscrew yeah let's just get rid of all of this so although originally I thought it was a file I remembered I had the box on top of the fridge so yeah I did forget to set the timer but that was an easy one to do today um, so let's tick day 17 and move on to day 18 which is kitchen gadgets if a gadget only does one thing you probably don't need it so join me tomorrow for day 18 this box is only sat on top of my fridge for a year bye now <laughs>